Our next technique is called Everybody Writes. And this is a great technique to use when you're doing a writing project. And uh, we as teachers use this type of technique uh, a lot and we use it as uh, think pair share we use it as a brainstorming activities but what everybody writes does and what teach like a champion the book what they they try to teach you is to use this technique by walking around the room and giving kids deep challenging questions that in return these kids are writing all these thoughts on their paper and then they go back and use all these ideas that they've written on the paper in their final draft the very the, the, the most important point of this is to challenge the kids by asking them probing questions that really get them thinking. Let's check out a teacher that uses this technique uh, really well in his classroom. So whatever our answer to that is, you can say no, Tecumseh did not change history. You want to have evidence to support that. You want to be able to create arguments and uh, use specific historical evidence to support your argument. Before you decide on any of those though, let's think about this. What are some of the characteristics or qualities that an individual must have to change history, you think? What are some of the things an individual must have? Before you answer that, I want you to brainstorm right now, individually, two to three characteristics that an individual must have. And I also want you to think about why they need that. So you can write that right there in that space, and then we'll start making a list of some of these characteristics. So you can think of an adjective to describe someone who changes history, a quality, a value. Okay, what are some of the things you guys came up with? And let's just make a list. Let's see uh, what kind of list we can generate here. Uh, what's the first thing you came up with, Kaisha? Okay, so you have to have a sense of justice. Interesting. Um, what else? Kier. Yeah, bravery. Bravery. Uh, bravery. Or we could also include with that one of our core values, courage. You have to have brave, bravery or courage. Why do you think you need that, Kier? Great, courage or bravery to stand up. I'm gonna add that, that's well said. What else? Uh, Brittany. Uh, that's a good word. I love that word, persevere. You gotta be able to